Okay. We're good to go? Mm hmm. Okay. I unplugged the valve for a moment to see if I could duplicate a power outage, but apparently it has to be out for longer than a few seconds. So we're going to assume that the screen has lit up, and if it is flashing, you can use the up or down arrow to get it to stop flashing and show the correct time of day. As you'll see in the upper right corner, there's a black arrow showing p.m. and it's 3.22, now 3.23 p.m. So to set it up, we need to hold the set and the up button together for approximately eight seconds. Here we go. And now it's showing 2 a.m., which is what we want. And that is regen time, when it's going to flush on that day. And I'll show you in a moment how we set it up for every 14 days. Could be every seven days, but to make it on the same day, every two weeks, we're going to set it up after I lock it in. The two o'clock needs to be locked in, 2 a.m. The minutes also need to be locked in. 2 a.m. The 14 is how many days before the next flush. And that needs to be locked in as well. Set button again. Let go, showing the time of day. Okay? So if I want it to be every Thursday, every other Thursday, every two weeks, just to show at this point, I would start the flush again by holding the up and down arrows together. And it now goes into flush mode. But since it's already flushed today once earlier, we're going to use the up arrow to take it to the second part of flushing, which is the forward link, by pushing the up arrow. Now it's stopped. It's changing gears. It's going from backwash to forward wash. And if I push the up arrow again, it's going to go from forward wash to stop completely. This is not the normal length of flush. It would normally be 16 minutes plus one minute for a gear change from back wash to forward flush. And when it gets done now, it should go back to the time of day which it did. And that is how to set up the clack valve. But if you want to change it from once every two weeks, when it's at days in between instead of 14, you could make that seven. And remember, you have to lock everything in with the set button, the hour of time of day flushing, the minutes have to be locked in. Then when it goes to the number of days in between, once you pick the number of days, you need to lock that in with the set button as well. But that's how we do it, and thank you very much, Faith. You're welcome.